Good morning, everybody. It's breakfast time at the Howl House. Two of my favorite guys here eating breakfast as man man. I'm sorry, TJ. TJ, we're calling him TJ now. So he got his mouth full. And there's Norik. He's mesmerized looking at SpongeBob. There we go. So they're eating some good old crunchy uh, turkey bacon and a cup of oatmeal and, of course, some good old cold water. And there's Norik with his breakfast over there. Thanks, Norik, for that good old smile. So, I just wanted to tune in with y'all this morning because, of course, I'm looking at the news and I'm listening to all the things that's going on and just could not resist the opportunity to come on and just on this beautiful overcast morning just to come on and uh, pray for everybody that's in Philly. We know you all had an overnight situation and we just hope and pray that if any of our YouTube family was in involved in that. I had loved ones involved in that. We we just praying for y'all. We just walking around the kitchen I'm trying to get over here to the window. And we're praying for love, as always. We pray that love would abound and take over that situation in Philly. Um, we just simply don't know what's going on. Yes, I just wanted to uh, invite y'all to say, come on in this morning. It's breakfast time. Uh, this is just a uh, a little off schedule um well it's not off schedule because i, I want to pray uh this morning of course we uh, know we've been listening to the news so we want to focus on love this morning and we are praying this morning that love would abound and that these prayers and these well wishes would go out across this world and people would latch on to love because if we have enough love in our heart the negative things will be washed away because we have all kinds of things both large and small that come to our family so uh over breakfast this morning i prayed over my children's food this morning they said my two of my favorite guys are here with me this morning and they're sitting down relaxing enjoying their oatmeal and bacon and toast and you know i believe in doing it with food so we can find love in anything so i find love in food conversation and in just loving people so we're just going to focus on love as we pray for our uh, sisters and brothers in um up in Philly where they had that overnight uh, mishap, this, the shooting in uh, Philly. Just It seems like every day that we get up, there's a shooting or somebody has uh, had some kind of mishap or there's inclement weather where it's hurt, harm, and danger has come. And, you know, we still have to continue to pray. As I always say, we need to pray without ceasing because there's forever something uh, to pray about. So this morning, we're going to focus on love. And, and as we... Uh, as you pray with me, we're just going to focus on love and just ask that love would abound in the hearts of our family and our friends, both at home and abroad, our YouTube family, just wherever uh, we encounter people, just wherever we go, whatever we do, whatever our thoughts are, we're just going to focus on love and the goodness of God because there are just so many beautiful, wonderful things in this world that we can focus on besides shootings and hurting each other and bad mouthing each other so this morning we ask in the name of jesus that love would abound that uh as the weather comes through and lord we know we cannot do anything to control nature but lord we ask that we would take heed to the warnings and that we would be kept out of harm's way and as the word of god said if we perish we perish but we want to know that at all times we have the word on our mind in our hearts and ready to proceed out of our mouths so, Lord, we just ask today that you would give us that new grace and mercy that you said that we could have. You said we could have new grace and mercy every day. So we come asking. We lay all troubles and trials and tribulations at the uh, throne of grace today, Lord God. And we just leave it there and we let it lay there, Lord, because you said the battle is not ours. And that's what we have to learn, that this battle is not ours. It's yours, Lord, because you did it on the cross for us. So we lay those uh trials and tribulations at the throne of grace and we move forward in this day because we can only live one day at a time so we come asking for our grace and mercy for today oh god and whatever things that we encounter i lay mine there and i invite you to lay yours there so for everybody within the sound of my voice oh god we ask these blessings and others and even as this prayer goes out that it will spread abroad for even for those who are not hearing it right now that uh, those who are hearing it, though, 
would carry that word forth. And it's about love. We're going to say it's about love today on Thursday. We're going to say it's about love. Loving one another. Loving uh, our sisters, our brothers, the people that are close to us and those that are not. So in the name of Jesus, we decree, we declare, we claim love on this Thursday. And uh, on this warm, humid day on Thursday, we declare love throughout the world so that we can move forward as you would have us because after all one of your last commandments that you left us you only left us two and you said that that we would have no god before you and that we would love one another as you love us so lord we claim that today in the name of jesus and we go forth now as we start our day off we've already gone to work uh, we've already had breakfast or not or whatever we do wherever we are we claim love, oh God, and we just thank you and we praise you for this day. And Lord, I thank you for my YouTube family that uh, we are growing. And Lord, I pray that everyone that has subscribed to my channel is hearing this prayer as it goes forth. And will be part of that group that stands in the gap for those uh, who are on their way to you, Lord. And we pray that everyone that we know will come running one day asking, what must I do to be saved? Because salvation is there for the taking. So we thank you and we praise you on today. We claim this day of love now on Thursday. Just remember, this is this is what we're going to think about. Every time we want to say or do something or, or think about something that's not about love, it, it is about love, y'all. It's about love today. So uh, with that being said, this is going to be a short video because this was like... Um, I wasn't planning on taping right now, but when I turn the TV on, like I said, every time I turn that TV on, I got something new. This is something new to pray for. So my Philly fans, my Philly fam, we pray for you, and uh, we pray that you, you will make it through this day. And for you, those of you who are directly involved, then, of course, we ask that the love of God will come into your heart and to your spirit and carry you through this tragedy. And for the people in El Paso, those 23 there, and for other areas around the country, all of the negative things that have been happening to you, we pray that this day of love will give you some kind of relief. I had uh, someone that was uh, in my neighborhood that was close, one of the young people that passed away on yesterday, and I'm lifting uh, that family up uh, in the name of Jesus, that daughter, that husband, that, that mate, that significant other. We lift that entire family unit, the friends around them, around that family, Lord. We just lift them up to you today, Lord, and we pray that they will go forth and know that weeping man do it for a night, but joy comes in the morning. And, of course, we have to seek that joy through the love of Christ. So we thank you and we praise you one more time oh god thank you to my youtube family love you guys y'all uh continue to uh support one another and thank you for supporting me so we're gonna say um that's it for today because like i say this is one of those things that i was just uh i had an auction this morning so i thought let me get on here and, and share this prayer that's in my heart about love today so uh tyra if you're watching hey hey little girl hope you're on that stove cooking something and Mama Faye, keep it going. Proud of you for that uh, YouTube channel that you got set up. You know. <laughs> anyway, just want to say one more time, I love you. Thank y'all for subscribing. Thank y'all for thumbs up in me. And thank y'all for propelling me into whatever my future is on YouTube. So um, until I decide to tape again, thank y'all for tuning in. Love you guys. Toodaloo.